Hello everyone, it's I, The Collector, here to bring you the second video of the Sinnoh Tour. Today we're going to be fighting Origin Form uh, Dialga. This is a dragon and steel type, so it's going to be weak against other dragons, fighting types, and of course, fairy and ice. Today I'm using Rhyperior, Machamp, Garchomp, Lucario, Houndoom, and Shiny Breloom. There are currently six of us on the clock, as I did with the Palkia Raid, although I'm going to literally show you how to battle it, how to catch it, and it can it be shiny. Right, we've got 11, 10 seconds on the clock. As always, Lady of Raptors is here with me as ever. Say hello. 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 Right, she's here because she's everything. Aww. Now, we've got one second on the clock. Can we beat it? Let's see what we're in. We're 44 seconds in. There's Origin Form Dialga, looking like something from a horror movie. And at the moment, we're using Rhyperior, and we're actually on the move. Still battling in it, and already, oh, and already my Rhyperior is nearly dead. Someone's using Shiny Groudon, isn't that nice? Someone using uh, Conkador, so the fighting type is also good. I'm just going to continue to attack it for dear life. I think that we'll be able to actually beat this one. However, we need to actually continue to actually punch it, but at the moment, nearly two Mon are down. Still going further and further as we go. I'm just going to go over here, away from people. At the moment, we're now trying... Nope, we got Garchomp using ground types. And Garchomp is almost dead because, as you know, Dragon v. Dragon is basically going to one-hit KO each other, especially from a Legendary. Let's continue to go and see if we can beat it. We're still using Power Up Punch like Lucario is here. Lucario is good because it can use Power Up Punch, which, as a side effect, will raise its attack. I don't know if that applies outside of PvP, but hopefully it does. We've now got it in the yellow. And we've got... And we're going, and we're going, and we're continuing... All right, at the moment, we're now got it down to the yellow. Lady of Raptors, do you think we can beat it? I think we can. You think we can? Yes. Okay, the girl says we can do it, so we might be able to. At the moment, I've now got Houndoom on the horizon. Probably should have Mega Evolved him. But as his dark type, his moves are not very effective. And for some reason, Go does not always select the perfect team for you. All right, and now we've got Shiny Balloon, another fighting type. And hopefully, and we've got it down to the red with 196 seconds on the clock. At the moment, we're still going in this hit, and so far, we've not been able to get a shiny, but we're continuing to go. Now, remember, this is a free event, so but it does cost extra money for raid passes. I'm just glad we got in range of it for a change and didn't have to use a remote raid pass. And all of my mon are dead. Isn't that fun? Right, I'm just going to rejoin the battle straight away. Now, we're using shiny Blaziken, which, obviously, as a fire and fighting type, is going to be doubly good if it doesn't get slaughtered in the next five minutes. Okay, let's try Blaze Burn for a move from the community day. Uh, no, Blaziken. Oh, God, Blaziken didn't last not long. It lasted like 15 seconds. Okay, we're using Landorus now. Go, male genie thing. And with 155 seconds on the clock, it's down. All right, now we get the wonderful move of seeing how difficult it will be to catch. And can we catch it for the video? We got lucky with Origin Form Palkia, but Dialga might be a different story. Let's just do it. Let's just do the quick summaries. Right, I'd like to give a I'd like to give a shout out for my girlfriend, Lady of Raptors, or Sil three five zero double five, due to the fact she got the final strike. Rob Gregory ten got the hardest hitter, and Mister Waswas two walked five kilometers. Isn't that nice? Okay. No shiny for the girl. Can I get lucky? Shiny, shiny, shiny. Not a shiny. Oh, well, let's. it's there. Get it for the decks. That's all that matters. As usual, golden rising and curveballs are going to be your friend. Can I get it on the first ball? Oh, no. Such luck. How's it going for you, Lady Raptors? Terrible. Not catching it? No. You'll get it. You always do. Been on the last raid. Okay. Oh. She's not a cheery person, folks, but I still love her. Yeah, oh, get it. Nope. No. Gone? Nope. I'm not going to catch it. Right, I'm on 15 balls, and I've only got a nice throw. Can I catch it? Oh, oh no, this, this Dialga does not want to be caught. Cool. I need to catch it now. Okay, is this going to be a lock-in? No! All right, 12 balls. we still got a chance. As long as it doesn't do its annoying attack. Great throw, and this thing does not want to be caught. Great throw again, getting to protected mode. Is it going to stay? No, it isn't. Once the All right, nine balls left. We can do this. The crit catch would be nice, but, you know, can't have everything in the world. 
The good news is, is that this is a big, big old mon, so it's easier to hit, even for someone as clumsy as me. And, and locked in! It. Yay! The Elga has been caught. Isn't that nice? Right, so as always, it's also got um, a new attack, which you can learn. And uh, you can enter in, actually, nearby showcases. Let's just check our IV. Check it out. Oh, wow, Hi. that is good. Oh, if that was a hundo, that would have been a lovely way to end it. So anyway, that is origin for the Dialga, sorry. As always, dragon types are your friend, fighting types are your friend, and fire types are your friend as well. Fairy types, because it's effective against dragons. Then again, steel might prevent it. But anyway... Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Digimon, and dinosaur-related content. And we hope to see you again soon. Bye. Bye.